as I have been progressing through, we are at the inauguration. We are sandwiched. It's kind of funny. There's no place to go, but people are trying to move. And I've met somebody who wants to be interviewed, so here we go. Hi! I'm Tori. And what are you doing here? Trying not to be squished. Trying not to be squished? That's all the fun, I think. So what, do you, what did you want to say? What was the interview for? I don't know. I just want to be on TV or something. Or something. <laughs> well, good thing it's or something. Yeah. I mean, unless YouTube picks this up and it goes to a million visits or something, and then the, then the broadcast networks pick it up, and who there knows what go. can happen there. So, so you, gotta, you better say hi to Daddy. Hi, Daddy. <laughs> and anything special you want to say to get you on network TV? Something that makes you stand out? Where'd you come from today? Cincinnati. Whoa, uh, hey, that's awesome. another issue. Nice. We had two buses, and the, the one bus was late because our driver had a heart attack. And then, and we were on the second bus, that was why we were waiting forever for it. And then we finally got started, and the first bus broke down. So we were waiting, our second bus was waiting for the first bus, and decided that we couldn't wait anymore. So we went to breakfast, our bus went back to pick up the first bus people brought them to breakfast and we got on our bus and we headed on out. Their bus broke down a second time. We didn't get into Winchester. They didn't get into Winchester until about 7 o'clock last night. We were supposed to get there at 10 o'clock yesterday morning. And so it was quite interesting. So my 45 minute walk down to downtown today, nothing. Oh, nothing at all. Yeah, it's a two hour drive from a hotel to get here. And it was about 50 minutes alone sitting on the bridge over the Potomac to get up here. All the way from Cincinnati. That's special enough to get on network news. Yeah. <laughs>